we follow the principle of non-alignment, which is very good. We do not want to be aligned with any foreign power, especially on security. But over a period of 20, 25 years with the advent of democracy, our foreign policy is not only non-alignment, it's become non-engagement. So this is getting problematic. Now, if you remember you 1989, when there was a blockade, there were a lot of countries, European, American countries, saying what India has done is wrong. We had the similar situation 2015. But there was not a single friend who spoke up for Nepal. So what we have to realize is non-alignment is okay. But if we don't engage with global powers, then we are going to run out of friends. Now, there is this misconception in Nepal where people say pro-India, pro-China, pro-America, this guy is close to this. It doesn't work that way. Now, let's just uh, take Bangladesh, for example. In Bangladesh, they're building a Chittagong port. In that port, they've taken assistance from both China and India in the same project. It's not been a problem. Or Hamro Panchayat time ma East West Highway banao dakhiri. Some part was done by India, some mm -hmm. part was done by China, some part was done by Russia, some part was done by the Europeans. Panipachi, this is how uh, diplomacy works. We have to engage with ev everyone. We can't say we can't engage with so and so. We can only engage with um, one country. So we need to be open with everyone. Of course, when we are open with everyone, we have to be clear. We are uh, in between two great powers. Mm -hmm. Population-wise, they are the two largest um, uh, populated countries. One is the second largest economy in the world. One is the fifth, probably going to be the fourth largest economy soon. And a military power in their own right. Mm -hmm. So when we deal with these two countries, we should not see it as a threat. We should see it as an opportunity, the market. And even if the crumbs fall from the table, it will be enough from us. But we have to know how to get it. Thank you very much for watching us on YouTube. Make sure that you also listen to us on Spotify.